Hejka, witajcie moi mili, z tej strony Rosiwo i jest to kolejny odcinek The Walking Dead Sezon pierwszy Dobra, zagadajmy ze wszystkimi Ogarnijmy sobie jak You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale, like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. Mm -hmm. That's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just... Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then I can't take away the things we... The things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Anybody in their right mind would. Families and barbecues and beers with good friends. All of those things. Those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Dobra. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Dobra, czyli tu już pogadaliśmy. Musimy zapomnieć, że Clementine jest pierwszą klasistką. Nie wiem, się przyda wyliecznie. Kenny? Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I think I've got it handled okay. As long as I keep her safe, I think I'm doing all right. With those things out there, maybe, sure, that's enough. But you gotta ask yourself if you're the type of guy who can do better than that if her parents don't show up. I'll keep that in mind. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Katya's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. See you. Actually, <laughs> You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. Dobra. Pogadajmy z Seanem. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bytes to length, that sure speed things up. Dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. 
Was the boy one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. I had to shoot one. I could shoot one, maybe, if it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My brother and parents are in Macon, I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Okay. Hey, Lee. Still need a hand? I'm good. Maybe go check on my dad in the barn. No, bro. Look at that, Miss Waldo. Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. Ty powiedziałeś jak nie? No, z wora rozmawiamy z Herschelem jeszcze. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I was on my way out anyway. The timing of all this just happened to be right. Huh, if there ever is a good time for the supposed apocalypse. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh, <laughs> had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon, with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. Bo taka sama była prawda. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did, but you better become a better liar and fast. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. So whoever you are and whatever you did, keep it to your damn self. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Go! I'll get my gun! I'm okay, Pop. I'm okay. I can fix you. 
Don't worry. We'll stitch you up. It, it almost... It almost got me, man. It, Lee tried to save me. I know, son. I... Get the fuck out of here! I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry! You tried to help him, but this piece of shit let him die. I wasn't strong enough. I'm sorry. If your girl is ever trapped, you better hope you get stronger. Or your friends are cowards. Please. Just go. Get out and never come back. Przerwam bana sytuację. You've got that ride to make it if you want it. Well, this is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Fuck! We're trapped! Ah! No! 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 Stay shut no matter what. I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. It could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? They would have died out there. Then we let them. We have kids with us. I see one little girl. What is it? I... I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. She's an asshole, that's for sure. That's what it takes. Well, you don't have to be a bitch about it. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. Mm. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! We, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It's... Lily, I'll handle it. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. 
They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things! What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten! Please stop this! It's upsetting him! Oh, I'm upsetting him! Upsetting is getting eaten alive! What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch! She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. Then we deal with it then. But right now, we're just freaking everybody out. Then get ready to deal with it, because that boy is bitten. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now! You're right, man. That boy is a term. <sighs> Kurwa, nie to miał być. Settled. Lee? This is my boy, Lee. My boy. We can't. I'm sorry, Kenny. Nie tak miał być. Nie to miałem na myśli. Kurwa. No, he's not bitten. Look, look, he's clean. Not a scratch. Not a goddamn scratch. What do you think about that? It's Larry, and I'm fucking sorry. Good. Look, we're fish in a barrel here. With all the commotion, we could be under siege any minute. We better start fortifying this place. I'll work on getting that window barricaded. Good. Dad, sit down. I'm fine, Lily. Dad, please. All right. Zdolny. You okay? Just great, thanks. Uh, guys? Everybody down! Stay quiet! They're gonna get in! Shut up! Is that the military? Whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Shut up. Uh, uh. I did try to get him to calm down. Can it, asshole? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible, so we can all get out of downtown naked. Fast. Agreed. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it, and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. 
And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Wojskowa już nie lubi. Lili już się ewidentnie nie podoba, że traci władzę. Not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. Okay, let's see what we have. Oh, what do we have? How's it doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. You didn't have to call me a bitch in front of my people. I don't need that shit, all right? It's hard enough to be in charge of people's lives without some dick cutting you down. And you should know, I didn't think he was in the right. You didn't say anything, and Duck could have been bitten. Sure, I guess. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. He's got a temper. Ah, oh, fuck you. Yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that. Yeah. We've got kids here, family. He and I are a family. I'm just saying, some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell, well, it seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found her in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. Well, I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with the sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force base. No, but I'm... Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah. Fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dowd hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. I'm gonna get back to him now. Dobra, postarajmy się pogadać ze wszystkimi. Biuro, nie, bi do biura jeszcze nie idziemy. Drugi baton. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. Some of the mama. No, it's all melted now. Don't even come over here. Kenny? No, cat. This son of a bitch would have let that man feed our son to the wolves. Stop that, Kenny. We were all frightened. Even I thought that maybe... Maybe we were going to lose our boy. Cordelita. I'm sorry, Katja. What if he... It's okay, Lee. From here on out, Lee... I need to know that you're on my side. Yeah, I am, of course. Good. Thank you. How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? Now the family's dead, so... That's awful, Lee. Yeah, well... She seems to be handling herself all right. She's just a little girl, Ken. Lee says she spent days on her own. That takes toughness. 
But you have no idea what sort of emotional damage is happening to her every second her family is gone. No, to jest też racja. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. <coughs> Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? They uh, own this place. They uh, pulled some bodies out of the office before we got here. They're uh, gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they're dead. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. Lee, you got a second? Sure. On se chodzi? Co się dzieje? Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. I panicked, you know. I'm not proud of it. It happens. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. Yeah. That's rough. I killed that boy. We could have saved him together. You didn't have a choice. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Tak samo jak... Try to let it go. No mam nadzieję, że z Kenem w miarę dogadamy się, bo jednak on też ma rodzinę i... Tutaj jednak, idąc tym tokiem... Idziemy w tą... Idziemy tą samą motywacją, nie? Rodzina do rodziny. No, Fotografie pewnie rodzinę znajdziemy. No, to będzie brat jego i rodzice. Historic Hunt Motel. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store. No, 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 no. This... Oh, huh. uh, not right now. All right, let me know if you want to. Na razie lepiej nie wychodzi, ze względu na to, że tak człowiek nie wiadomo jak będzie się tam na dworze wszystko brało. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me, and I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. That guy saved you? Yeah, can you believe it? Those creeps or, or ghouls or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kind of cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Huh? Huh? Oh, nothing. Hmm. <laughs> How'd you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. Okay. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work though. Here, let me have a look. Okay, co może być z radiem nie tak? Energia. Nothing. Okay, obróćmy. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? Do you know that there are no batteries in that thing? Yeah, of course. I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. No, no, bro. Let's look. I me. Let's have a gazette. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Hmm. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Okay. Put on a shirt. Hey there. Hi. Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. Can I uh, get you anything? I'm okay. 
Maybe I'm a little hungry. I'll see about that. So, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... <laughs> I'm good. That's good. Yeah, I, I think so. Uh, being good is good, despite the circumstances. Yep. We'll sit tight. No, okay. mom is organizing a jart, więc. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. To take such yes. To mamy batona kolejnego, okay. Dobra, mamy dwa batony. Komu jeszcze byśmy mogli dać? Try to get some rest, hon. How can I with those things? It's not much, but here. For the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. Dobra. Tutaj zróbmy. It's not much, but here. You sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. That's uh really sweet. Don't mention it. Uh, ze względu na ojca. Dobra. Zobaczmy co tam będzie. Najważniejsze dzieci jak się nadły. Dobra, ale moi mili, po biurze rozejrzymy się już w następnym odcinku. Także dzięki za uwagę, trzymajcie się, hej!